We'll use both the circle's area and its circumference for this one. Okay, let's find our arc length here. So we know that the area of our sector is equal to 16 over 3 pi. And so that's going to be the same as the fraction that the sector makes up times the area of the full circle. So the area of the full circle, fraction of the sector, times the area of the full circle will be pi r squared, and r is 4. So that's 4 squared times pi, 16 pi. And that equals 16 over 3 times pi. So we can just see from observing this that that fraction must equal 1 third. So the fraction of our, of our circle that is the sector is equal to 1 third. So our arc length covers 1 third of the circle. So the total distance around the, the circle, the circumference, is going to be 2 pi r. And r is 2 times pi times 4, which equals 8 pi if we multiply those out. And our fraction is only 1 third. So the arc length is equal to 1 third of 8 pi, which is 8 over 3 times pi, which is our answer.